Hello everyone, this is Srileka from MSc Data Science Department. My project is about diabetic retinopathy detection using deep learning. Coming to abstract, diabetic retinopathy means it is a complication that is caused due to the diabetes which affect the human eye. It is caused due to the swelling in the blood vessels of the retina and mainly seen in working age group people, which may cause permanent blindness also. There are many methods by ophthalmologists to detect diabetic retinopathy, but it involves manual examination of retinal image. But in this project, we detect diabetic retinopathy in an automated manner. For this, we have taken the data set from Kaggle, that is called IPAC data set, which consists of 35,126 images and trained using GPU and achieved an accuracy of 95%. These are the images of normal eye and diabetic retinopathy eye. Literature review. In 2016, a paper was published titled as Development and Validation of a Deep Learning Algorithm for Detection of Diabetic Retinopathy in Retinal Fundus Photographs. In this, the majority decision of all ophthalmologist creators are taken as the majority of the ophthalmologists could not identify the correct findings for images, it is difficult to perform algorithm well. This is the main drawback for this paper. In second paper that is published in the year 2018 with the title Development and Validation of a Deep Learning Algorithm for Detecting of Diabetic Retinopathy in Retinal Fundus Photographs. In this, it was the review paper that is taken from two papers that is IPAC's data set and Messi.data data set. They have taken the two data sets that is IPAC and Messi.data to, to evaluate the algorithm performance. IPAC is a data set which is based on the DRS system to simplify process of image capture. In this, the main drawback is they did not provide hyperparameter settings. But in the later pages, they have published it. In 2019, another paper named as Transfer Learning Based Detection of Diabetic Retinopathy from Small Dataset. In this, they have taken the small dataset and performed the transfer learning in which deep CNN have been achieving high performance results on the image classification. In this, they have used the Inception V3 model to develop the algorithm performance. Inception V3 model is is a model that helps to extract different sized features of input images in one level of con convolution. Fourth paper is about the deep learning approach to diabetic retinopathy detection in year 2020. It is the early detection of the diabetic retinopathy for the treatment. In this automatic deep learning method is used for stage detection of single photography. In fifth paper, which is published in the year 2021, titled as Diabetic Retinopathy Detection and Retinal Image Generation. In this, they visualize the symptom encoded in the uh, image and then they propose the pathogen model to synthesize the retinal images. In this, they generate an image. It may take long time but in this by using pathogen network our image takes less time and it can be used both by doctors as well as users in the existing system to detect the diabetic retinopathy it is the time consuming process for the trained ophthalmologist as well as the users but in proposed system they detected these types of stages of diabetic retinopathy by single photography images by using the TensorFlow and the CNN and achieved an accuracy score of 95%, which is better than the existing system. System architecture. In this system architecture, we will be taking an eye image, retinal eye image, and perform inception with the model. Then the features are extracted from it then it will post to the fully connected uh, layer and then it predicts the types of the diabetic image. There are 
few system requirements for my project that is hardware requirements and software requirements hardware requirements such as windows 7 or above and processor needed is i3 or above programming language is python front end we will use flask flask is a python web framework built with a small code and easy to extend and back end we will be using mysql mysql is used to connect the databases environment we use is anaconda and data set we use is kaggle data set we detect this types of diabetic retinopathy majorly we have two types of diabetic retinopathy and five stages of the diabetic retinopathy types of retinopathy that is non proliferative and proliferative non proliferative is nothing but it is easy to detect this early stages of this diseases proliferative is advanced form of the diseases stages of non proliferative and proliferative diabetic retinopathy first stage is mild non proliferative retinopathy it is the earliest stage of diabetic retinopathy caused due to the swelling in the blood vessels of the retina and second stage is moderate non proliferative retinopathy non moderate non proliferative retinopathy is caused due to the increasing swelling of tiny blood vessels that start to interfere blood flow to the retina third symptom is severe non proliferative diabetic retinopathy in this a larger section of blood vessels in the retina become blocked causing a significant decrease in blood flow and the fourth is proliferative diabetic retinopathy detection it is it is the advanced stage of diseases in which new blood vessels from form the form in the retina and last stage is no diabetic this is a sample data set from the kaggle that is ipad data set these are the output screens of my project where i will be showing you the execution after the conclusion and the future announcement conclusion this paper is mainly based on the detection of the type of diabetic retinopathy and uh, and performing the accurate result that is we performed the result and they reduced the learning rate which gave us the 95% result future enhancement uh, based on the future enhancement the security issues are mandatory so it it can be increased and additionally we can propose the amount of injury grade that is if we give the type of uh, diabetic retinopathy we can uh, detect the amount of injury grade of diabetic these are my references and coming to the execution this is the home page of my project first we have to register with the username and password user and password email id mobile number all and then click on register now we have to sign in with the same username and password click on login now we have to upload the images of i we have to select the image and then click on upload view image here then we have to click to predict then we will get the type of diabetic this is a image of no diabetic retinopathy here we can even here we can even consider more images also 
to detect. See one more image. We can upload more than one image and click to predict. Then we will get the type of diabetic retinopathy detection. It is having severe diabetic retinopathy. Then we have to click on logout. That's it. Thank you.